Well, hello, a very warm welcome to you for this evening's game. Regrettably, the weather has been extremely unkind to us here. It is wet and blustery and remarkably inhospitable. Despite all of that, it is good to see that the faithful from both sides have apparently been undeterred. We have a terrific turnout here. The atmosphere is bubbling despite these adverse conditions. All we need now is for the game to live up to its initial billing. Old Trafford rising to the occasion as only Old Trafford can. Some terrific scenes at the Stretford end. It does seem to be a 4-3-3, Jim. Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And, of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard-working jobs, but if they can gain a one-on-one -on -one advantage, they can dictate. So we're up and running. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Christian Eriksen. He's super accurate with both feet, Peter, and able to deliver a cross or a... Cristiano Ronaldo! Superb goal! And what a great way to start the game. To spark the game, the captain has basically triggered a contest that should be even livelier than we anticipated. Get the seatbelts on, this could be rather exciting. Manchester United have an early lead. Good start. We sit high. Goalkeeper's ball. Diogo Dallo. Diogo Dallo plays it forward. Rashford has a look inside the box. Diogo Dallo. Tomine. And here's... It's Cristiano Ronaldo! He has done it! And with the match still in its infancy, they are easing away. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. The second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. United take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Alex Tellez. Rafael Varane. It's the early days, but the difference in fortune is very clear. Rashford, full steam down the flank, pumps it into the area, and through to the goalkeeper. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Gets into a dangerous position. And that's been levered clear. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. 
McTominay plays it out to the flank. Rashford. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Matic gets it back. Rafael Varane. Alex Tellez. Alex Tellez goes looking. Matic. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo tries to get it forward quickly. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Alex Tellez. That is terrific skill. It's anyone's ball. Can he deliver? And it's been taken straight back. Whipped it. Massive leap! In he goes again! Rashford with a predatory goal. Our players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great coaching positions. How quick minded was that? Reply. This is becoming a stroll. Gets it back. Forward it goes. Knocks it in gently. He's has a hit. Manchester United are in control here on the brink of half-time. Looking to hit the front line. Eriksson... ...has a hit! And yes, it's there! With time and space aplenty, he was never going to miss. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. So, is this the start of a comeback? Bruno Fernandes, and it's played forward. Played out to the right. Diogo Dallo has come steaming up from the back for this. And the whistle goes for half-time. Well, it's hard to say whether a two-goal advantage under these circumstances is decisive or not, but so far, I haven't really seen enough to indicate that the opposition... It's the start of the second half. Idea just poorly executed. He's gone for it! And he's there to make a great save. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade.
McTominay tries to clear. Hoists it forward. McTominay battles to win it back. Gets wrestled off the ball. Eriksson. Ronaldo, two goals to his name already. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and the fact that he's red... Rashford! Quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. I might sound a little harsh here, but the keeper, I felt, could have done a better job in ensuring that ball didn't go back out into the danger area. Manchester United grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. Try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. Alex Tellez. Time to deliver. Nothing but a skill there. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Tries to get it clear. Forward it goes. Lindelof. forward it's a long pass but not the most accurate Janssen Janssen plays it forward Rashford and it's Cristiano Ronaldo Rashford Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot on sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both fearless and costly from the right city. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single handedly. They don't know how to stop him.
so now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Well, to wait until now to make this change seems a bit baffling. He's expecting the Miraculous to turn this around from here. It's become a case of men against boys. Can't get the better of his opposite number. He's not played the ball, that's a foul. Around with the clearance. Alex Tellez drives it towards the front. Rashford. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Ericsson. Rashford. Alex Tellez. Lindelof. Mm -hmm. Official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Diogo Dallo. Diogo Dallo drives it forward. Away from immediate danger. And that's that. Manchester United, very much the dominant side, almost the only side. Every time they put on the ball, they look like scoring. It is a landslide. Could you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Yeah, we knew there was a sizeable gap in the quality of both squads, and, and the story was told in predictable fashion.